Okay, here's the next measurement. Um, I've now moved uh, the, the bottom trace is now the input signal but measured right on the uh, the input grid of the first preamp tube um, and the upper trace is uh, one half of the phase inverter output um, and what we can see here again the phase seems to have shifted a little bit No, this is the out of phase signal in the in the phase inverter, um, but it's not in sync. It's out of sync there. Okay, now let's see if we try to measure on the other other half of the phase inverter. One second. We'll shift the uh, the measurement here. Shift the probe to the other, the other half. Now let's see what we get. Now this is the, the supposedly in phase, signal. But it's it's not in phase anymore. Now if we try to zoom in on the, on the uh, and by the way this is where the, volume is at. I don't know if you can see it. It's about two. Uh, let's try to to increase the uh, the the volume. One second. Now oh, it's starting to distort. You know, you can see it's no longer a a true sine wave. And there's some funny stuff happening right at the swings. Um, increase the volume even more. Let's see. And the shape is just <laughs> distorting really badly. Turning down the volume again. And then it's sort of. Uh, the, the the shape takes on more of a uh, a normal appearance, but uh, this distortion is happening very early. It's like just the um, the volume is now on about two and a half and three five. I'm not not certain, but I think there's a lot of um, high frequency noise going on in the amp, um, possibly from the rectifiers. I don't know. We'll see if we can find out.